things going. You can feel the intensity of this one. Total playoff atmosphere. We're underway. That knocks him off the puck. Great heads up play to poke it away in the offensive end. Quick feed to Ehlers. Nice zone entry on the left side. Vancouver's looking to break out of their own end. Hughes scoops it up here inside the defensive zone. Puck grab by Miller. From right out of midair, he bats it down. Winnipeg's got the puck against the half wall. Huge steal at his own end. That'll create some separation. Some players get into the game by physically engaging early. There's a fine line there, but that was executed perfectly. Play whistle dead offside the call. Still plenty of time left in this frame. Still no score in this one. The Canucks win the draw. Poked away at center by Ayafalo. The Canucks take it along the wall. Turned aside by Helleba. Here's a short pass to Zadora. Zero fear on this guy's part as he blocks it. Great poke by Kuzmenko. Here we go. The Jets will play it in their own end. Good hit to knock the puck loose. From point blank range, denies him! Puck scooped up by DeMello. Hellebuck's made a great save there, and everyone can breathe a sigh of relief coming off of that blowout last game in the playoffs. Important to reset in a good one, and he gets a good start. Oh, and a misfire as that goes right out of the zone. And now it's to Lafferty. And he takes oh. the feed. I know I stepped on your toes there, James, but had to react to that massive hit. The Jets take it along the wing. Dumps it in. The Canucks scoop it up along the boards. Vancouver's got a hold of the puck. Shot! Here's a shot! And he stakes that one with the club. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. Still looking for our first goal. Winnipeg's got the puck after winning the defensive zone faceoff. Appleton's into the offensive zone now on the attack. Goalie's masked on the ice. Referees blow the play dead. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. Blugers won a big draw on their own end. Through the offensive zone and behind the net now. Coming to the slot. Oh my goodness, it stayed out. What a save. It was all but in James, and that athleticism and the will to get to that puck, that was on display. Uh, he's reading these shooters so well. He's getting in front of them. He's aggressive, and he's challenging them to beat him, James, and that's what I love about him, a ton of confidence. Coughs it up on the play. And now it's grabbed by Schmidt. The Jets move it ahead. Wax it into the offensive zone. Now a quick pass to Garland. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. Takes a shot, and he keeps that one out. Looks to get the puck over to Lowry. Line chain. Shot. Oh, how did he get a piece of that? And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Stemko's got that light work zone ability, which means he can get a read on the shooter and square himself up to the shot to make the save. Shifley's won the face off deep inside the offensive zone. Taken by Hirono. The Canucks take it across the line. That's blocked by Hellebuck. And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. We've still got zeros on the board.
Winnipeg's got a hold of the puck. And now it's over to Ehlers. Reaches out and pokes it away. Suter's taking it from his own end. Hughes plays it along the wall. They've got the defense outnumbered. Oh, what a save on the play! Oh, such an athletic save, James. I mean, that's just all about competing, finding a way to get to the puck. I really want to look at this last save again, James, because this is about taking it to the next level. When you have this level of competitiveness, athleticism, and desperation and urgency in your game, you know that goaltending coach, they can't just teach this. This is instinctual, and this is what winners are made of. Face-off looming as both centers get into position. Good job tangling up his opponent here. Connors carrying it ahead. Oh, what a stop with the paddle! Passes on over to Pedersen. Moves along the boards with some purpose. Sends the pass in front. Moves it again. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. From the back of the cage with the puck. Oh, he made the save. How did he stop it? I have no idea, James. I mean, he was down and out, but profound athleticism and desperation got him back in to make it. And these fans are still passing the puck. And we just saw what a yeah, I mean, he scores! Brock Besser steps up big time. I hear coaches preaching all the time, take away the eyes of the goaltender. What does that mean? It means you get yourself in front of that net, whether it's a double stack, a double screen, whatever you can do so that the goaltender can't find the puck. And he couldn't as he drops to that butterfly. He tries to make himself as big as possible, but he can't catch up to the puck. Vancouver's capitalizing their offensive abilities here in this first period. Quick pass to Dillon. The Canucks take possession in the defensive end. Moves it to Lafferty. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. Hellebuck's really impressed me tonight, James. Just look at that last sequence and that death. Puts it off the post. The Jets are working hard to get back in this game. They wire it off the post, but they're generating offense. The coach, the staff, the entire team needs to stay confident here. They're generating the looks. They just have to find a way to execute. Up along the wing. That's some smart heads up defensive play by Hoaglander. Poked away at center by DeMello. The Canucks take it across the blue line. The Jets gain control of the puck. Moves it to McKay. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Hellebuck's going to hang on for a whistle. Pedersen's playing with such confidence right now, and he's got this point streak going. And when that's happening for you, you're having a ton of fun putting up the points. Late goings of this period. Vancouver's ahead, 1-0. Grabs it in his own end. Great pressure to force the turnover by Bulger. Dismissed that chance. Stuffs him again. Well, this is an incredible save, James. It's anticipation as well. Recognize that the shooter is in the low slot, getting in front of it and making the save. Gets the puck in deep. The Jets have it now. Moves it quickly over to Perfetti. Moved up ahead after a nice pass from the right wing. Puck sent over to Heronic. The Canucks play it along the boards. Puck dumped in. Tenacious battle for the puck along the wall. Taken along the wall. Puck goalie's best friend comes up big again as it goes off the outside of the frame. Oh, he saved it. What a stop. Now that's desperation at its finest to be able to get to that puck and send a clear message to his team that he's behind him. He's going to be the foundation tonight. The goaltender, they have to have talent. They have to have mobility. They have to be able to track the puck, but they have to have a willingness to find it and fight for any second shot, and that's exactly what happens here. Out battling, out willing, and you make the save. Vancouver's look great thus far, leading here late in the first period. And with that, the first period is in the books. Both teams with a chance and a refresh will get a clean sheet of ice and come back with period number two. Period number 
Number two set to go here. Officials moments away from dropping the puck. Here we go, middle frame now underway as the puck drops. Well, Cheryl, already a third of this one played. What do you make of this one? Hell, that's been fantastic in the game. Scores! Pop and Bobby Purcelli! What a shot! That's just adding insult to injury, isn't it? James, a top cheddar shot that just sends the water bottle assailing. The goalie coaches work all the time with one screen or one player in front, James, and he's got to do a good job of finding this puck. I mean, it just beats him clean. The Canucks are showing off a not-so-subtle flex here tonight, now up by a pair in the second. Well, you know how the mindset changes and how much more confident you are when you're getting great goaltending, and that's what's happening here. And now they're getting a ton of shots on net. They're dominating in terms of that, but they're creating a lot of momentum in the offensive zone that's resulting in goals. Oh, he's going to feel that the rest of the game. They are wearing down their opponents with hits like that. Who's it in front? It's James, and it's about the stick position, where that puck in relation to where the opponent's stick is. I mean, he is driving, he's putting on a clinic in puck protection, and slides it over to his teammate for the goal. Winnipeg suddenly made this a lot more intriguing here in this second period. I know it's cliche, James, but the game is 60 minutes. It's only the second, and they've got themselves within one. A lot of one way to go. Well, Lardy's quick stick lands from the puck here at center. Here's a shot from the top position. Scores on the rebound and puts it home. Well, I really like the effort on this goal, James. He shows a knack for the net and being real hard and heavy on his stick as he's able to put that rebound in the net. Goaltender's got to clean that up, though. That one got kicked right back out. Winnipeg's really changed the complexion of this game. Look at this. We're all evened up here in period number two, Cheryl. Yeah, and to do it at the beginning of the second is key. You really want to dictate pace and send a direct message to your opponent, and they do that with that goal. Puck picked up by DeMello. Quick feed to Ayafalo. Puck grab by Miller. Vancouver's got it across the line. Just a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. Here we go, pucks in deep. Can't maintain possession after that hit. The Canucks gain possession. We'll get a face-off after the puck stays covered up. Lots of time left in this period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Winnipeg's won the draw and they'll go to work. Oh, stopped it! What a save on the play! And there's nothing technical about that. That is all about the will to find a way to make that save incredible, James. There's no question the goaltenders know who the shooters are in the league and what style of shot they take, and he's able to get a perfect read on the shooter here. That quick release shot, he knew that wrister was coming all day long. And he makes the save. Centering pass, and that's stopped. The Jets are in transition. Vancouver's regained possession of the puck. Stops him with the glove! Puck is frozen, and we get a stoppage in play. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. We are all tied up in this one. The Jets win that offensive zone faceoff. Great reach with the poke check. Vancouver's ready to go on the attack. Puck scooped up by Gustafson. Here's a short pass to Lowry. Fires it on net. Stopped by the goaltender. Directed over to Lafferty. Into the attacking area from the left side. Center feed. And it's blocked. Takes the pass. Oh, big time saved by Hellebuck. Quick pass to Dillon. Winnipeg's got it along the wall. From the slot. Way too much congestion blocks that. Oh, he hammered him on the play. Oh, this is just a thunderous hit. Talk about physical engagement. He got all of them, James. <laughs> that was big time. Both teams 
are set. They're ready to drop the puck. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. And he takes the feed. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Here's a blast. Vancouver's got the puck in the defensive end. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. Turn that chance aside. Sabra faces the body. Here's the chance in front. Block shot. Hellebuck's putting on a clinic tonight, and he's been busy right from the get-go of this game, right from puck drop, and it's almost as if he got dialed in right away, and he built momentum, and he's feeling it. And he slides it quickly to Heronic. On man rush. Only oh, just gets a piece of it to keep it out. Puck is frozen, and we'll get a face-off. Past the halfway mark of this period, it's all tied up. Vancouver's won the draw. Good reach for the stick to knock the puck away. Taken here by Miller. All quick work with the stick and comes up with the puck. Tries to feed it over to 
to Hughes. Oh, what a slick stop by Hillebuck. Here's a short pass to Pion. The Canucks gain control of it. And a nice takeaway in the defensive end by Dillon. Big hit, and that frees up possession. Play is called for offside. The Canucks need to start finishing on some of these chances here as we're now late in the second. Bluger's won the draw at center. Winnipeg's got a hold of it along the wall. Concludes the second period of play. Still one more period of regulation time. We'll see what happens in the third next. Time to drop the puck here in period number three. Well, two periods down. Here we go with the third period. Cheryl, your assessment so far. The Jets continue to lead in this third period, but the question is for how long, James? I mean, this has been a back-and-forth, action-packed game of offense. I don't know. I wouldn't like to play in this game because I was all defense, and there's none of it tonight. Oh, just a great heads-up play by Ehlers. Gaining momentum up along the side. A little dipsy doodle, and he loses possession of the puck. Ehlers is such a creative player. If he sees an opening, you know he's going to take it. He's an aggressive style player, and he tries to attack. But when he does it there, he loses the puck. Slides it back to the blue line. Let's it fly. Here's a shot. And it's stopped by the club. Nice play there. A timely save is everything to your team. And this goaltender, he bails his team out. Lots of time left in this period. We've got ourselves a 4-2 hockey game. Winnipeg's going to start with the puck in their own end. The Jets get a hold of the puck in their own end. Big time collision, and look at that. He landed right on his own bench. Well, you know that the one giving the hit likes this, to send a message, send you right over the board into the laps of your teammates. It's embarrassing either way. No question that you got off your feet and you wound up on your bench. Solid hit on that play. Vancouver's gained possession along the boards. Quick pass to Zadora. Cuts to the front. Oh, a clutch save! What a fantastic save from a high danger scoring area, James. And I mean, he's bailing his team out. They have to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. What pressure here in the offensive end. Across the line and on the attack. The Canucks have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Steps across the line and on the attack down the right side. Love save made by Hellebuck. There's the whistle as the puck stopper likes to hang on. The Canucks' enemy is starting to become the clock as they still trail here in the third despite several scoring chances. The Jets win the draw here in their own end. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Moves it over to Perfetti. Carries it into the offensive end up the middle. The Canucks have the puck now. Oh, it sounded like a car crash. Makes a save. Gets a piece of it with the glove. Look, and that goes off the post. Here's the pass. There's a hit on the play. And that's intercepted by the defense. Steps inside the attacking zone down the left wing. Oh, he kind of struggled with that one, but he got just enough to keep it out. Hellebuck's been really sharp tonight, James, and then just have a look at his save percentage, and he's making the stop that he needs to. But man, his team's played well. They've got going north, they've created opportunities, and a reason why they have a healthy lead. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. Winnipeg's doubled up on them. It's now 4-2. Hellebuck's got the puck, and we'll get a stoppage in play. Well, and this is a huge play right here, just recognizing the tempo of the game and being able to dictate it. He's done it all night. Teams are ready for the draw. The linesman about to drop the puck. 
Clock has dropped and we are back underway. Passes ahead from the right side. And just like that, comes up with the puck. Great little flick of the stick. Picked up along the boards by Connor. Winnipeg's got possession of the puck. And the puck dies with the trapper save. Shifley's won the draw and they're on the attack. Here's a shot! He's gone! coaches talk about and if they can finish this off with this nice lead that's the word the coach is going to be preaching after the game great defensive effort with the strip denies him again he makes a great read on that puck james i mean the quick release wrist shot that's a tough one to stop all the shooter wants to do is catch you off guard get it in behind you but he gets square to it and he was right there to make the stop on that play he does a great job of having sound positional play based on where the puck is on that low inner slot and he makes himself big takes away the holes and makes a save Here's a shot! Big time stop! Moves it to the middle! He scores! What a goal! Listen, James, when he works himself into position to set up for that one-timer, if you're his teammate, you just find him and you deliver it to him. The Canucks haven't had a lot of things go their way tonight, but they finally got a positive here in the third. They're going to have to outnumber their opponent if they want to call back from this two-goal deficit. They're running out of runway. they got to find a way to get some chances. Vancouver's going to start off with the puck here in the neutral zone after winning that faceoff. Joshua's got the puck. And that ricochets off a twig in front. Hellebuck's going to wait for the whistle, and I don't mind this strategy here, Cheryl. Me neither. I mean, he's having himself a game, isn't he, James? He has been dominant between the pipes, and he knows he needs to pounce on this puck. He looks up at the game clock. They're winning. Not much time left in the third. they got to figure out a way to play it safe. And now it's grabbed by Barron. Great pressure with the stick. Grabs the puck. Sent into the offensive zone. Oh, what a hit along the wall. And that's a clean one, James. A great angle, shoulder to shoulder, and just laid it on thick. The Canucks are across the line and into the offensive end. Great hand eye to knock the puck down. And it's a quick pass to Hughes. Drives to the sweet spot. Oh, what a stop on the play. Gets all of it with the paddle. Oh, what a big time hit on the play. Well, and it's another hit. I mean, how many times is that now, James? He's going to continue to be a target if his head is down. Knocked away by Ayafalo. Along the half wall with the puck. Tried to get 2Q with it and loses possession. Ayafalo's known for his creativity, and he tries one too many moves there, and he loses the puck. Here's a chance. Blocker save. Slip feed. Blocked in traffic. Well, this game is wild, James. End-to-end -end action. Let's just forget the defense, shall we? And just go with the goal calls. Winnipeg's got control of it now from their own end. Nice zone entry from the right side. Here they come on the attack. The Jets have it from their own end. And now he moves it quickly to Ehlers. Winnipeg's top line has been just that tonight. They've contributed offensively, and they're a reason they're in the lead. There's the whistle as the goalie hangs on. Carla Bade is standing by with her answer to the head-to-head -head matchup tonight. Carla? Pedersen's had the upper hand in this battle, guys. His scoring prowess was on display, and it's a big reason why I'm giving him the edge here. And he slides it quickly to Pedersen. Sends the pass over. What a steal in his own end. 
Coming down the left wing and into the zone. Through center along the wing. Moves the puck to the attacking area. Quick pass across to Besser. That's just textbook positioning to break up the play. Goaltender is pushed. Yeah, this one will all but seal the deal. James, a real insurance marker and a game well fought and a win well earned. As that empty net pool went in, everyone on the bench and on the ice knew that that put the game to bed. Vancouver's time is running out in this one to try to even things up. They've had plenty of scoring chances, but no finish tonight. Under a minute to go in the third. Slides the puck to Cole. Moves it to Garland. The Canucks will play it against the wall. And somehow he hangs on. And that caroms off a body in the lane. Vancouver's got the puck along the boards. Taken by Chisholm. And as the final seconds tick away, listen to this place. Recognize a hard victory. Goaltender covers up. We got a stoppage in play. Officials ready to drop the puck and get things back underway. Takes possession off the draw. 